Hello and welcome to the World's RV Show going on now at Motorhome Specialist, the number one volume selling motorhome dealership in the world. My name is Donnie O'Banion and today I am very proud to announce that Motorhome Specialist no longer just offers the largest and most diverse selection of motorized RVs in the world, but luxury fifth wheels as well. And folks, you're in for a real treat today because we're being joined by Brian Walchek, who is the general manager of Thor Industries Heartland Elk Ridge Division and he is going to be sharing with us a wealth of knowledge and taking us for a tour of one of the most popular luxury fifth wheels in the industry today, the 37 Ultimate. Thank Brian, you, thank you so much for being here today. Well, first off, we want to tell you that everybody at Heartland is thrilled to be a part of Motorhome Specialist and this awesome transition to Heartland fifth wheels. So as you know already, Heartland was founded in 2004, roughly 10 years ago, and we started with the highest end fifth wheels we could. The reason we started with the highest level of fifth wheels is knowing that if we had our quality consistency at its highest level, we would then be successful at every price point that followed. Now, for the last, for the, exactly. Now, for the, for the last 10 years, we've been building into those price points. We started with the Landmark, and now we're building the Elk Ridge fifth wheel. The Elk Ridge fifth wheel is dynamic because of its use of space and value. But before I get to all the great features on the Elk Ridge, let's talk about where Heartland has been for the last 10 years. Heartland started out as an independent company. The guys that started Heartland all worked within the RV business. Hundreds of years of knowledge and experience in building towable and even motorized product. But what they did was they wanted to build a better value for customers. They turned the industry on its head. Other companies were raising the price and taking out features. Heartland turned it all over and started adding extra stuff and charging less money. That was the value that Heartland created and customers recognized it. Heartland was in business for roughly about six years and then they got noticed by the largest RV company in the world, Thor Industries. Absolutely. So Heartland went from private ownership into public ownership with Thor. Thor gave Heartland the ability to create systems, better customer support, and dealer support to promote and elevate the company to where it is today. So Brian, what made Heartland decide to start with fifth wheels instead of starting off with the traditional travel trailers and building from there? Well, travel trailer market has always been flooded with product and it would be very hard to separate ourselves at Heartland with just a travel trailer product starting out. That's why we started with the fifth wheels. Fifth wheels have been known for safety, convenience, and unique floor plans. The way the weight is distributed on a fifth wheel makes it one of the safest towing vehicles on the market. Along with the diverse floor plans, taller ceilings, we offer floor plans in double, triple, quad, and even five slide models now. No so we have something for everybody. And, you know, could you elaborate a little bit uh, about that force as far as uh, some of the more popular floor plans that are available right now? I know we're going to be taking a look at the 37 Ultimate, which is, you know, again, one of the most popular floor plans in the industry. Uh, but of course, you know, you make them a lot of different shapes and sizes so <laughs> to fit everyone. And, uh, you know, if you could tell us a little bit about the available floor plans right now before we delve into the 37 Ultimate. Sure. sure. Well, what we do at Heartland is a little different with our floor plans. We spend more time listening to customers. Heartland has the largest owner's community online of any towable manufacturer. And this is statistically researched in depth on heartlandowners.org. What they do is they give us specific feedback on what we need to do to our products to make it more usable, more livable, and more fun. So as we talk to these customers and listen to our customers more, they say, do this, don't do this. What are you crazy for doing this? <laughs> and we listen to our customers. Absolutely. That's what's given Heartland its success is our ability to listen to our customers more. That's the key. Yes, absolutely. That's the key. <laughs> now, as far as floor plans are concerned, when we put a floor plan online, we actually poll many of our owners club to see what they think of it. Okay. They want to see, is the kitchen in the right spot? Is this here? So to break it down scientifically on how we design floor plans, which is the heart of great selling fifth wheels, sure. we look at three, three primary things. Is it a couple's model? Is it a family model? Is it a multi-sleeper? Is it going to have the sleeping space and the storage necessary to make that customer happy? Right. And we want them to not just buy one, we want them to tell their friends. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. That's when you've done your job right. Absolutely. Absolutely. So specifically on floor plans, Elk Ridge is our primary product we'll be talking about today. Okay. Elk Ridge focuses primarily on the core of the market right in the middle for what people are looking for. Okay. Elk Ridge can be divided up into two primary spots, the regular Elk Ridges and then the Elk Ridge Extreme Light. Today we're going to be looking at the regular Elk Ridges. Okay. If there's two phrases that really sum up an Elk Ridge, 
The first is champagne taste on a beer budget. <laughs> we want people to have the look, the feel of luxury. And the way that we do that with Elk Ridge, we borrow a lot of the key features from our high-end product, right. and we buy in such volume, we can include those features in the Elk Ridge and do it for less money. Truly, that's the big thing about being a part of Thor Industries it, is, of course, the buying power. The buying power is key with Thor, absolutely. No question. When a customer considers an Elk Ridge, they can know that it's better designed, it's better equipped, and has more features than anybody else in that price segment. So that's what we do, the champagne taste on the beer budget. One of the biggest things about the Elk Ridge is also what we call full profile size at a mid-profile price. Okay. That's the value. Elk Ridge features full stand-up bedrooms, taller slides, taller ceilings, and it comes in at the same money of more of the mid-profile fifth wheels on the market. Okay. Well, you know, Brian, I know that people would love to really see some of the feature benefits and, you know, some of the things in particular on the 37 Ultimate and, um, you know, just start really getting a, an idea of, you know, some of the things that we're talking about here. This is exciting. Let's start right up here. Okay. Well, so I noticed that y'all are painting the front caps. Yeah, one of the biggest features on the Elk Ridge is the outside look. The outside look of the Elk Ridge gives it the curb appeal people are looking for. Now, it's, it's easy to do full body paint, but what Elk Ridge is, it's a full body paint look without the full body paint cost. Right. We paint the fronts, but on the side we use a high gloss gel coat. This cream, what we call pearl colored sidewall, okay. gives it the look and the appeal. All of the colors are then blended in with the graphics on the side that make it look like a full body paint coach. Right, it blends right in with the stripe kit. Absolutely. But I mean, it uh, completely changes the, the front end, as you said, curb appeal you know, of the Elk Ridge. Absolutely. It really has a high end look. And one of the things that we did this year on the Elk Ridge product was instead of using mountains or animals or some crazy scene on the front, we wanted Elk Ridge to have the elegance. And so we added a stylish E and the flowing graphics that go throughout the coach. Very nice, it was really well done. It, it, looks, it looks fantastic and the response from customers this year has been phenomenal on the Elk Ridge. I think the days of just having a standard white coach are way behind us right now. They're, they're gone. The look is just one thing. As we get into the functionality of the coach, let me tell you two things right here that make the Elk Ridge totally unique. Okay. Heartland was one of the first to uh, prototype and build what we call the 88 degree turn radius. Now, what this is, it's the frame, the cap, the sidewall, all of it is cut back because in recent years, many of the tow vehicles on F-250s and F-350s have gone to shorter beds, six and a half, six foot, or five and a half foot beds. Okay. Well, in the old days, that would require a customer to buy a slider or glider hitch. Having the 88 degree turn radius allows your customers or our customers to, to not purchase that slider or glider hitch and still achieve uh, uh, stronger, bigger turns okay. without the... Uh, crushing of their rear cap. I gotcha. Yeah, so it was a pre okay. pretty nasty thing going on. And and something like the 37 Ultimate, uh, this this size of unit, what what typical size truck is, is needed uh, to pull it? The general rule is so long as the truck is a diesel pickup, F-350, 2500, uh, that we designed this product specifically for that truck. Okay. So you, if some customers are more comfortable feeling uh, using a dually, uh, okay. That's not required. This this okay. product is built in the uh, moderate pro size and weight range, so it can still accompany uh, a heavy-duty truck in the 250 or 2500 range. Great, great. Now the large areas up here, you know, in the front, um, you know, it's a little bit different type of storage. I notice from what I'm used to seeing, you know, in the motorized world, um, you know, being um, uh, you know metal. Metal skin are these are these traditionally used for more rubble, rugged applications like toolboxes? I mean, how are people utilizing this space traditionally in a, in a fifth wheel? Well, that's a great question because many of the fifth wheels you're going to find right at the bat, we use every possible corner for storage. So here in the front, we call this the true basement storage. Okay. This is what a lot of folks use for wood tools specifically. You'll notice some knockouts here inside. So if a customer yeah. did want to prep their coach with a generator for later, uh, it can be done very easily. <laughs> that's that's really cool. I never even thought about yeah. wood, you yeah. know, stuff like that. But it's just easy cleanup and you know, yeah. take your campsite with you. Yeah. Uh, really even here on the sides, Donnie, we've got uh, a tremendous amount of storage here inside these uh, uh, side pass-through doors. Okay. Some of the things Heartland does is we Whoa. use thicker pass-through doors, slam latches, and they all have magnetic holdbacks. 
One of the reasons we went to magnetic holdbacks is I took my mother-in-law camping and we had the clip on the side. Well, she pulled down and ripped the clip clean off the wall. Everybody's put, done it. Everybody's <laughs> done it, absolutely. So when you look into the Heartland storage, the first thing you notice, it's clean, okay? There's not pipes, wires, or any obstructions going through the inside here. Even the ceilings are insulated and finished. Many of our competitors that are in this price range, they simply don't take the time to finish the, the uh, pass-through storage. Right. When we want our customers to buy a Heartland, we want them to be confident that everything is finished and done. Now, uh, incredibly well done. And I noticed that you have 110 and it looks like coax cable there, so it's really easy to install an exterior TV. Absolutely, That's, that's and, and right behind this wall here is many of the appliances that you may need, like the, the converter, which takes the 110 power and converts to 12 volt. Okay. It's easily accessible right behind this wall right here. Okay. And then on the other side, one of the things I'll point out in a second is a Heartland Standard, the Universal Docking Center. Why don't we go over and check that out? Absolutely, I'd love to. Donnie, this is what I was telling you about with the Universal Docking Center. Okay. Heartland formulated the UDC Center primarily after motorhomes. Motorhomes are so easy to use. What we did was we made a fiberglass thin box that included all of your hookups here. Your fresh water tank, your city water pressured connection, your black tank flush, even your tank poles are all fully sealed and insulated here inside the box. Okay. Now what separates this from many of our competitors who've tried to copy this is, this is made to withstand water. So if this gets wet, it's going to leak right down the bottom here and drain out completely, okay? Many of our competitors do it where it's open to the pass-through. Well, we all know in campgrounds, water pressure fluctuates. Sure. And just a pinhole leak will soak anything in the compartment. You can be confident when you buy an Elk Ridge that it's all sealed completely here inside. That's a great idea, truly. Now, we don't stop there. There's actually more because not only is the, is the coach prepped with the uh, uh, antenna and the power booster for the reception on the top, we also have the coach prep for cable and RG6 satellite line. So a customer can very easily mount a tripod outside and hook up here directly. It's a lot of wires. So what we do with the wires is we take this cap off here and all of the wires come neatly up inside this hole into the compartment here. So nothing is spread out on the outside of the coach. Nice. This is an idea we took directly from motorhomes and we were one of the first towables to do this. Customers have resonated with this because it's such a neat and easy way to, to hook up your coach. You know, I noticed something, you know, you mentioned motorized a couple of times, but this is better than anything that I've seen anybody using in the motorized world. Well, everybody's just using that little sprayer, you know, handle yeah. on the outside. You know, this is this is cool how you've got the quick disconnect right here. But I mean, this is a lot more usable than one of those little showers where, I mean, where basically, you know, all you've got is right here beside the coach. I exactly. Mean, what, what, what we've noticed, uh, in fact, uh, Donnie, I'm a camper myself, and most of our campers have pets. And with the pets, it's so much easier to have a longer size of hose with hot and cold water. Nobody wants to soak their pet with cold water coming right out of the spigot. Right. So this quick connect hose can not only be hooked up here, but also on this model, it can be hooked up in the camp kitchen area on the other side. So there's multi uses for this individual. Yeah, connector. and certainly it's going to provide better water pressure too. I mean, if you just need to fill a bucket, you know, to wash the dog with or there you you know, go. whatever. Yeah, and it's all done. Really well go. done. Very neat and easy to use. Now, we kind of mentioned some of the appliances. Okay. Um, what we've noticed at Heartland is a lot of customers do their research. So they want to compare it on paper, tank size, water heater size. Sure. And we know that. If you came to my office where I designed product in Elkhart, you're going to see all of that product laid out. And if they've got a six gallon water heater, I've got a 10. And that's exactly what we do. Because nice. when we design Elk Ridge, we're designing it for our customers and we want them to be happy. 10 gallon water heaters come standard, gas and electric on both. We encourage our customers to run the gas and the electric at the same time for the highest recovery rate. Right. Our water heaters can recover just over 16 gallons per hour with the typical suburban system here. That's that's awesome. Yep. That's awesome. And a 10 gallon is very rare. You know, again, I've got to revert back to motorized, but you don't see 10 gallon water heaters on virtually anything. They just don't go to the additional expense. No. But that's uh, that's a really nice feature. And a lot of our effort comes with engineering also. Uh, Heartland engineers take special effort where they place these items. For example, the water heater is going to be hot pretty much all the time. Right. We put almost all of our water heaters on the off-door side of the coach. Very well thought out. Yep. Very well thought out. Could we take a look? I'm really interested in, you know, some of the toys. You know, we've talked a lot about the build and so many of the, the key features that are obviously very important, you know, to the usability of the coach. And, 
you know, completely changes coach ownership, yeah. you know, uh, of, of your product. But of course, you know, I'm like everybody else. I want to see some of the toys. Okay. And I know that the ultimate is, you know, we're talking about exterior kitchen and mm -hmm. so many of the neat things that y'all are doing. Let's go over to the play area here. Cool. Cool. And now this is what I'm talking about. Well, Donnie, this is the party area, okay? And this is probably one of the biggest reasons people choose in Elk Ridge. This is the outside camp kitchen. And one of the things that we do, a lot of the things that we do, are all geared towards making a customer happy and comfortable. Here's what we do. We put the outside refrigerator here, which is 110 volt only, perfect for beverages and treats, so the kids can stay happy out here. Much larger refrigerator than what you normally find in, a, in an exterior camp. Usually all of ours are about half this size, but is that because the additional height that you get out of a fifth wheel enables us? To exactly. You're going to get the extra size in our fridges, not just the typical 1.2 or 1.3 cubic foot fridge. Yeah, and I noticed you got a freezer in there as well. Absolutely. Got to have ice. Yeah, right? you don't. Yeah, and that's something else you typically don't get. Another thing that many customers are discerning and really compare our product is they're going to notice that the countertop height is actually lower in the Elk Ridge than many of our competitors. Uh, we design our product for all heights and sizes, tall and not, not so tall. So you can still reach inside here. Inside, we've got the sink. Now what the sink has done, it's directly in the floor, not built up. Okay. The sink is plumbed directly back into the tanks. That's key. Many campgrounds nowadays don't want water just pouring out on the ground. Sure. Many of our sure. competitors just put a drain hole there and let it drain out directly. Remember that? Uh, oh, really? Remember that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Remember the hose we talked about before? Yes. We equip our Elk Ridge 37 Ultimate with this quick disconnect mechanism here. So you can take this spigot off and then put the hose in right here. So you've got two ports where really you can smart. wash it, wash the pets, fill a bucket, uh, even spray down the kids if they really need it. That is really smart. Now here on this side we also incorporate a lot of storage. That's done here around the microwave. Okay. A lot of customers said, hey we're out by the campfire, we're out enjoying a video outside. Need a second place to cook? That's truly what this is. Here in the back, we also have a quick disconnect for the LP supply. So it's really easy to hook up your gas grill, okay. get it connected up, and have a great time out here. No, it really is a ton of storage, and including these drawers, which, wow, those are a lot deeper. I thought they were going to be one of those little, little tiny ones. Dummy. Yeah. No, we, we, no those... we put the best drawers in. And one thing you'll also notice about all the drawers throughout the coach is we use higher quality roller bearing drawer glides. So they're very smooth, it's just not a plastic wheel that's gonna get chipped. So when they come in and out, they're unbelievably smooth and easy to use. No kidding, and they'll handle a lot more weight. Absolutely, absolutely. And even above us right here, the door is designed to act as a protective cover when you're outside. We designed this particular model for use on the outside. The awning comes directly to the camp kitchen and right. it continues over both entrance doors. So as we come down here and talk about the entrances to the 37, you're going to see how well thought out the coverings are on the side of the coach. Truly, truly. This is... Uh, well, no, let's check height. it out. That's awesome. Donnie, like I was telling you, when the engineers designed the Elk Ridge, they designed the outside to be a true party area. So the awning is placed directly over both entry doors. Yes, both entry doors. So the rear entry door here is access to the bunk room and, of course, the bathroom back here. No way. The Elk Ridge 37 Ultimate features two bathrooms, a full bath in the front and a half bath here in the back. A lot of folks buy this because they don't realize that all fifth wheels are designed with the main bathroom on the upper deck. Having a bathroom back here on the lower deck, it's less steps to get inside. So it's that much easier. Oh, that's really nice. Uh, that is just a great floor plan idea. Absolutely, absolutely. Customers are really responding well to that. In fact, Donnie, something we're doing here shortly is we're developing another family cup, cup, a family model just like the 37 Ultimate. It's going to have five slides instead of four and two full bathrooms. Yeah, a tub really? and a shower. No so kidding? we're doing amazing things with Elk Ridge. Two right full now. baths. Yep, you're going to see it. We call it the 38 RSRT or the 38 Resort. It's a fantastic model. I can't wait to see it. Let's, let me, let me show it. you some more. Now, this, okay. as far as some of the usability things inside the Elk Ridge, we even put this door here in front of the bathroom. Now, what this door does is this door has access here to the inside. Now, there's a cutout in the countertop here in the kitchen. Okay. Now, what this allows you to do is to put a big old trash can here inside. And so the trash has a place to go. Oh. Nice. Designers thought of everything nice. on the Elk Ridge. So with the trash cans here, you could neatly take the trash in and out without having to drag it through the inside of the coach. That's really smart. Yeah. 
Now here on the outside, of course, maybe I forgot to point this out, but all of our awnings are electric awnings and they okay. are illuminated with LED lights underneath. The LED lights are such a nice hit right now. In fact, most of the lights on the Elk Ridge are LED throughout. So they're lower power use, easier to use, and they last almost forever. And got a great look. Absolutely. Really do have a great look. I also notice you got exterior speakers Absolutely. on this particular model. So where's the source for this? Good, good, good question. On the inside, we have a head unit. It's a brand new unit, okay? Now what it does is it has three zones of speakers. The living room, kitchen, the bedroom, and outside. Okay. Each of those zones are individually controlled, okay? Now what's unique about the outside speakers and our stereo, it's all Bluetooth enabled. So you can pair your smartphone, your iPad, right directly to it, control the volume, here from your camping area without having to crawl inside and turn really the channel. Really cool. Really so cool. So you can watch Pandora, any music you have there on your phone. Oh, that is great. Yep. Now, it's really easy to get inside the coach. Come standard on the uh, Elk Ridge, we offer the oversized grab handle, the 30-inch wide entry door. Having a bigger, taller entry door, a little bit bigger than our competitors, makes it that much easier to get inside. The Elk Ridge is equipped with a wireless remote control device. The wireless remote control can very easily control many of the systems and functions on the coach as a secondary feature. Once you turn it on, you can then scroll through your front jacks, rear jacks, slides, outside awning, comes equipped with a flashlight, and can turn on and off outside lights. Donnie, there's so many great features on the Elk Ridge I want to show you. Construction benefits, drivetrain, tires, brakes, all that. But I'm more excited to show you the inside. Let me take you inside and show you why our customers love the Elk Ridges. Absolutely. Let's do it. Absolutely. Wow. Brian, this is really beautiful. Well, Donnie, one of the first things that Heartland wants to talk about when you come inside is all of the interiors are designed by women. <laughs> we have a great team of ladies that actually pick out the colors of the wood, the fabrics, and everything else. A really beautiful home on the inside. Right out of the gate, you're going to notice a lot of radius corners. Heartland focused on not only radiusing the corners to make it less pointed, but good-looking cabinets and useful, too. Heartland features what we call the Bordeaux wood. The wood is very good-looking, plus the European-style hidden hinges. This is something not traditionally found in this price point. But right. the European style hin hidden hinges are behind here and they're spring loaded. So you get to that point and they can close automatically. Really this keeps nice. your stuff inside the cabin. I was going to say when you're traveling, there's got to be a big thing in helping that, that spring loaded against whatever you've got inside there. Absolutely. And, you know, just going back to the styling of them, I mean, they, they're glazed. I mean, you've got this whole, you know, pencil glazing around here, too. And it's a little difficult to see possibly from, from that angle. But when you really get up close and, and look at it, I mean, it really has a rich, rich look and feel to it. Donnie, these are the details that only our ladies can touch. <laughs> so some other things you'll notice is, of course, here in the, in the inside of the fifth wheel, this is the tallest point. We've got nine foot ceilings here at the tallest point, which give fifth wheels their unique aspect with more size and more storage. Here you've got a 32 inch TV, which comes standard on all the Elk Ridges. Okay. Plus the stereo we referred to earlier. This is a 12 volt stereo. Now this is the one that works through your Bluetooth. iPhone and all that stuff. Okay, cool. Absolutely. It's AM, FM, it's a DVD player, and it does have the Bluetooth feature. All of the zones are controlled very easily, A, B, and C right here on the outside. So it's got a nice soft finish to it, so it does touch, uh, it does, it's very easy to use. Right below, you do see the optional fireplace. Now our fireplaces are, are really unique because they do put out heat. All of our fireplaces can put out over 5,100 5, BTUs worth of heat. So it's not enough to heat your entire coach, but it is enough to take the edge off if it does get cold. Absolutely, certainly keep the living room warm. Absolutely, it's got the good look and the th it's thermostatically controlled. So even on a day like today, if it's hot out, you could turn the heat off and still have it looking good. <laughs> you could have a uh, fire in the summertime. Absolutely. That is really cool. The, the furniture's got a, an incredible look to it. I mean, it's, you know, the distressed leather look. So, you know, like the wood itself, I mean, it's just an extra touch. It's really comfortable. This is a lot deeper than traditional, um, you know, RV style furniture. I mean, this is, this really sits well. You're, you're exactly right. Again, this goes back, back to our designers who've done such a great job designing this year. Our designers have partnered with Broyhill Furniture, the most recognized name in residential furniture, and every Elk Ridge comes standard with the Broyhill Furniture. 
Now it comes in three different decor schemes. Okay. What we see here is what we call the fabulous decor scheme. We always <laughs> laugh when they, they <laughs> called it fabulous because it really is. It does have, like you say, the distressed look because it's not leather. It's actually a microfiber. So for the folks who want the fabric look, but the leather, like the leather uh, look without the, the fabric feel, that's what the Fabulous offers. Absolutely. And it's much easier to keep clean and it doesn't crack over time. doesn't exactly. require this. We've actually tested the tensile strength too. So if you do have pets that want to jump up on top, their claws aren't going to tear right through it. No, exactly. I'm actually having to look into a furniture like this at my house because my bulldog destroyed my new leather wow. furniture in less than a year. <laughs> Now, so, the, the couch you're sitting on does make into a bed. Uh, this is what we call the salon-style sofa. So there's more storage in this under the booth. Each of these areas pull out and do offer storage underneath here. The salon-style sofa offers the booth-style um, furniture here. And this just pulls out like so. And that's got the uh, ball-bearing drawer glides as well. Yeah, everything's easy to use and easy to pull out. And while we're standing here in the slide down, please let me point out how big the slides actually are. Yeah. The uh, slide room height in all the Elk Ridges is six foot five. That's why we call it a full profile fifth wheel at a mid profile price. Me, I'm six foot two. And if I stood up straight directly off the couch, I'm going to bump my head on the slide. I don't want to bump my head. <laughs> so having a taller slide with more room and more space gives the Elk Ridge the open and airy feel that we're going for. Absolutely. Absolutely. And, you know, little touches throughout, you know, notice the 110 plugs are just everywhere inside and out of the coach. The additional cup holders over here. And, and I'm assuming your booth dinette actually, does that make into an, another Absolutely. sleeper? Absolutely. In fact, there's two additional cushions that come with the coach to make it into a bed. This particular model can sleep up to 10 people. Wow. It's a lot wow. Of people. That is, that is a lot now, of Now, Donnie, keep in mind, if 10 <laughs> people is too many, we offer many different floor plans, even couples models, we call them. Okay. That feature two to four people. So you have your main bed in the front with the additional sleeper there in the back. The really stairs. nice. And I'm sure they're shorter in length traditionally? Some are. We do offer everything from 29 to 42 feet. Wow. Some of our most popular models are our 34 TSRE. It's got three slides, a grand staircase leading up to the bedroom, and a TV in the back really a stellar model. I uh, gotten to see one. It wasn't here long, but I did get to see the first one you sent me. It was a beautiful home. It yep. really was. Absolutely. Now, I also noticed um, a little bit ago, just actually just from standing here, um, I thought that these were going to be halogen lights, um, you know, because obviously they put off a lot of heat. Um, these can't be halogens. No, oh, these, are, an LED? these are all LED lights throughout. Now, the LED light puts out zero heat. Uh, it uses next to no amps, so our power draw is, is next to nothing. The LED lights are, are where the direction of the R entire RV business is going, right? It makes sense. Mm -hmm. It makes sense. And just from a cooling standpoint, besides the less draw on the batteries, but, you know, you're trying to cool a, a coach down or, you know, cool this unit down, it's going to make a big difference in the summertime when you're not fighting against 50 light bulbs, you you're know, that exactly are emitting right. that, that kind of heat. We are in Texas, and I can't imagine how hot it can get here, but we designed the coach specifically for the heat. So that's why we put the big 15,000 BTU air conditioner here in the living room area. Okay. We also have the option for a second air in the front. Now, when a customer options in, which, which is pretty much what we do all the time for okay. our Texas dealers, okay? Right. But around the country, many dealers are always putting that second, second air in. Sure. That second air conditioner is ducted directly into the system. So you can run both airs and it'll force cool air throughout the entire coach. Really so nice. So you get twice the efficiency. Really nice. This is a feature that's not offered in this price point with other fifth wheels. So come on over to the kitchen here and let me show you some more of the great features. Well, you found the kitchen, Donnie. This is really an exciting area because what you're going to find here is what we call the two-step kitchen. Okay. Two steps means within two steps, you've got everything. One, two, you're at the fridge. One, two, you're back at the sink. <laughs> so all, like of our, all of our fridges that we feature in the Elk Ridges come standard with an eight cubic foot double door gas electric uh, refrigerator. Okay. They're efficient, they're Norco. Um, we also feature the pantries. Next to all of our fridges, you're gonna have an oversized pantry. Of course, with those hinges, special sure. nickel hardware, really looks good. Back to the refrigerator just for a moment, are all the wood inserts, is that standard as well? That is standard. In fact, uh, we do offer the six panel reefer inserts, really gives it a nice feel, blends in with the rest of the coach. It's a real high-end feel. It, it does. Makes the kitchen. Now, something I'll mention about the refrigerator, you do have both refrigerators available. This okay. is the eight cubic foot, but we also offer the four-door, 
12.7 cubic foot refrigerator also. Okay. Both will fit into this opening right here. And obviously you're going to get more refrigerator, but you're going to lose some of your pantry space? You lose some of the pantry and it is a little bit more expensive. We, we of course, build and more customers have them with the eight cubic foot refrigerator. Okay. Now, right next to the refrigerator, you're going to notice all stainless steel appliances, microwave, vents, and the stove itself. All very good looking and this all comes standard. It's not upgrade. We figure most customers want it to so just make it standard. So the stainless steel is, is standard? Stainless steel is standard, absolutely. Really nice. You're going to find some more drawers, of course, more roller bearing drawers and drawer glides here, all nickel hardware, and of course, solid surface countertops throughout. All of our countertops are LG countertops. Now, if you went to Lowe's, Home Depot, any of the home improvement stores and saw one of the finest cabinets out there, you're going to find LG countertops, the same countertops you're going to find there in the store. Beautiful. Now, something about Heartland that's unique is Heartland controls all of our sub-assembly. So we manufacture all of our own countertops in-house. This is very different from other manufacturers. What this allows us to do is to have better quality countertops. We build all of this in-house. You're going to see all of these cabinets here with undermounted stainless steel sinks, even pull-out faucets, all neatly done. Very nice. High-end faucet fixtures. And when you were talking about the countertops, I was very surprised. You know, typically these just drop off. It's just for show. This thing is solid. Absolutely. This thing is all one, one piece. I mean, it typically it just has that lip and then there's wood that cuts up underneath it for the savings and you really don't have much solid surface, mm -hmm. which is what I was expecting. And that is completely solid. As a camper, Beautiful I want to keep surprising our owners with new and different things that make them love their camp, camper more. And over here, you know, again, this was, uh, I guess this is where the, uh, that trash can access oh, is. Yeah, this is neat. Of course, you have to have a place for a trash can. And the outside door we showed earlier, that huge access here, you can of course throw all of your stuff down inside here and have it all put away in neat. You know, there's very few motorhomes or fifth wheels that have offered that. I, I've always loved it. I, I think it's such a, a, a great idea. I just don't know why more people don't do it. Such a great use of space and keeps the trash can, of course, out of the middle of your floor the way that they are in most floor plans. Well, after they see this, they'll probably do it. <laughs> <laughs> And then this right here too, I mean, my goodness, I mean, like you didn't have enough storage space and counter space over here as it was in pantry. You just got a hu another huge area right here. Can you be used as, uh, you know, I mean, pantry or yep. heck even linen at this point. I mean, you know, you just really is just a great use of space. And then the, the flooring. Yeah. Uh, what you're going to find in the Elk Ridge is we do offer a combination, of course, carpet and mostly a bow floor linoleum. Okay. Now okay. this isn't your typical vinyl floor covering, okay? Bowl floor is a six layer rubberized coated material that helps the floor maintain its integrity. It's soft, but most importantly, it's built for harsh climates in the cold weather. That's great, really easy to keep clean. Absolutely. And I understand it's mold resistant as well. Absolutely, it's mold resistant. And, and like I said, it, you can feel the texture of it. So it gives a good look with the wood plank floor and it actually has a texture inside of it that you can feel. It leads all the way up upstairs here too. It's got a beautiful look, no doubt. So this is the master bedroom and master bath area. Absolutely. And this is what we refer to kindly as the suite. And most of the Elk Ridge models are going to feature the king size bed. It's first noticeable up here. And of course, don't forget, I'm six foot two and I have plenty of room above my head to stand up here. Absolutely. So one of the things that makes the Elk Ridge totally unique is the full profile size here in the bedroom. So you can move around and feel comfortable. So some things about the bed, it's, uh, it's of course the bed is a king size bed, but we do offer the uh, pillow top mattress. It's a, what we refer to as the country rest mattress. Okay. So it's a full size mattress with that extra padding on top. Really, really nice feeling mattress here. Wow, yeah. We, we know some of the first things that people do when they buy their new coach is rip out the first mattress <laughs> they have and put a new one in. There's no question about that. They won't have to do that with this. This yep. is a really quality mattress. Yep. And we do put plugs and outlets, as we said earlier, on either side of the bed. So if you do have a, a machine that you need to use at night or an alarm clock, sure, you can plug them in on either side. I like how you've got windows on both sides. It's a, it's a deep slide. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, we're dealing with what? Four slides? In we're this doing, floor this four, four slides. Yep. And, uh, but you know, the, the bedroom, you know, traditionally in a lot of floor plans will be a really small slide where you can't get the window in, but this is really nice where you can actually get cross ventilation when it's just nice outside. Yep. And, and we, we focus on all of our floor plans offering those, uh, 
the cross ventilation there in the bedroom because it's so key in having that. Really nice. Now, underneath the bed, we do have storage under here also. Okay. So there's a tremendous amount of storage here for linens, towels, blankets, anything you need underneath the king size bed. That's great. And the closet is huge. Well, the closet is what we refer to as the full walk-in wardrobe. Every one of the Elk Ridges that has the full walk-in wardrobe in the front is washer dryer prep. We offer our customers a full stackable washer dryer, one on one side and one on the other side. What that also does is allow you to balance the weight better. So you can have a washer on one side and the dryer on the other. Nice. Of course, that closet rod goes from side to side, so there's plenty of room up there. So hanging clothes, storage. I've had people that told me they put uh, uh, filing cabinets there in the right, front. Right. Uh, multiple uses there in these huge closets in the Elk Ridges. Really smart. Really yeah. smart being able to run the split washer dryer like that. Yeah. Not only that, but we also offer huge uh, banks of dresser drawers here, too. Yes. Uh, these dressers are huge. There's six full, full drawers here in this particular model. And I love this huge, you know, basically floor to ceiling window you have here in the bedroom. I mean, that's just got to be great at night. You know, and you're laying in bed and, you know, you turn the TV off and you got your campsite outside. I mean, it's just got to be awesome. Absolutely. Really. Well, while we're up here, I might as well point out two other real quick things. Of course, okay. we have the LED lights, but that air conditioner I talked about that's so critical. Uh, most fifth wheels are going to offer a drop-in air conditioner. Now, this air conditioner is integrated into the AC duct system, so it's going to cool the coach better. In this price point, that's just not done. With the Elk Ridge, you're getting a lot of the high-end features at that mid-profile price. Your main bath, the full bath here in the front, offers more floor space than many of our competitors. Every bathroom comes with porcelain toilets, foot flush, and the oversized shower. Our showers are enormous. Even the sinks and the medicine cabinets offer you more storage space. And you know, you've shown us so much, you know, in this floor plan. I mean, it's, it's hard to believe, but there is a whole nother living area we haven't even looked at yet. Yes, it's enormous. Bunk beds, family room, and more storage. And the <laughs> half bath. Let's go check it out. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> this is awesome. This is what an unbelievable room. family room. This is really what makes the ultimate the ultimate. Over here, we've got bunks on top, even the bunk down below. This bunk folds out of the way when we're in transit or when you want to use it. Check right that there. out. What a great use of space. Yep. And what really makes this floor plan unique is with the dual opposing slides, it gives you over 14 foot of space from wall to wall. That's huge. There's more floor space in the 37 Ultimate than any other fifth wheel that offers this floor plan. Well, I mean, yeah, I mean, you know, you're talking about these, these set of bunks, obviously opposing bunks over here on this side, but like I said, with so much additional floor space right here, I mean, it's just, you can just see game chairs and, you know, I mean, this is like the kid's room. Absolutely. I mean, you know, truly there's just so much extra space that And not just space, storage. Come on back here. Let me show you the storage this has. All right. This is the area, Donnie, that people buy the uh, 37 Ultimate for. If you've got kids and if you've got family, you have to have a place for their stuff. And they're not just little cabinets. These are big, deep <laughs> cabinets that go all the way back. Look at the amount of size inside this rig. That's crazy. I was not expecting to see closet, oh, closet space here. You've got shoe storage underneath and even this nice entertainment center right here in the middle. Yeah, I mean, as I said before, I mean, I mean, what a perfect place to bring in, you know, game chairs, additional seating. I mean, I mean, heck, you could put a lazy boy back here. Absolutely. <laughs> you know, I mean, it doesn't have to be for the kids. I mean, this is like the man cave. <laughs> well, a lot of folks mistake this for just a bunk room. This is a party room. You can take out a bunk, put a chair. We even have the option here at the uh, factory for the uh, for a sofa instead of the lower bunk here. Oh, really? Yep. That's a great idea. Yep. Truly. So that makes out into a full height of bed. But again, you're going to find storage everywhere. Drawers underneath the bunk. Absolutely. All roller bearing, wow. full extension drill glides. Not cutting any corners. And look how big the windows are in the bunk. Yep. And it's really nice. Something else I'll point out as we came through the door. They're all real doors in between our rooms. We don't use uh, curtains or screens. All of our doors are solid all the way through. Does this, this actually appears that it folds up. Absolutely, it does. It just folds up like so. That's really cool. It just opens the room up if Absolutely. you're not using it as the bunk. And then of course, the half bath. 
I mean, so, you know, nobody's having to walk into the master bedroom, bother you at night. Just an incredible floor plan, Brian. And Donnie, that's why we call it the ultimate. Isn't that great in there? Unbelievable. Well, I mean, the sleeping space is just it really unheard is. of. It really is. As I promised, I really want to show you some of the construction benefits of the Elk Ridge. Okay. okay. Every sidewall, like we mentioned earlier, has the high gloss pearl sidewall on it. Okay. Right. But what you don't see behind it is this is a fully laminated sidewall, six full layers, overlapping luons, so you don't see the seams starting to come apart. Right. Many of our competitors just butt the boards up against each other and they start to come out. These are smooth all the way down, easy to clean. You don't see the fibers inside there. No. Very attractive. Now, something that's critical on a fifth wheel, of course, is the wheels, axles, uh, tires. And this is a, a, a big important thing for the Elk Ridge because we spend a little bit of extra money, much more than the uh, competitors do, emphasis in the tires and wheels. Okay. First off, we use 16 inch wheels standard. All of the tires are connected directly to Dexter axles. That's key. Dexter axles are the best in the business. We want our customers to be confident that when they're riding their, their Elk Ridge and driving their Elk Ridge, they're going to have better tires. Now, here in between, you're going to see equalizer. Heartland uses rubberized equalizers in the, in the, uh, between the axles here. Okay. What that does is absorb a lot of the energy here rather than traveling up through the coach. So all of the speed bumps and extra uh, jarring that are going to be out there on the roads is, is absorbed right here in the equalizer. Which is, you know, I didn't think about it. You know, I just think of motorhomes, you know, obviously the drivability, you're in there when it's squeaking or rattling or what have you, but it's it's got to be just as important because the the life of the coach itself, you know, to make sure that the cabinets don't loosen, that it still stays, you know, that the box itself, you don't start to open up seams on the yeah. inside. We or, don't want you to open the door of the coach and have your dishes all over the floor. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> no, that's, that's a really uh, great feature. So between the equalizers, the leaf springs, the Dexter axles, the oversized tires, Elk Ridge has the best drivetrain on the market. Underneath, we fully seal and enclose the entire underbelly. That makes the season of this coach even longer. So you can extend your season into colder climates uh, and keep your tanks heated. So there's, there's heat blown directly on the tanks. Okay, so is, are, that was my next question. Are the tanks themselves, are they heated from the furnace? Or? From the furnace, yep. Oh, that's great. So yep. it's not just an electric heat pad or, no. or what have you. So this is a true all seasons coach. You can take it where you want. Exactly, and, and the good news is that if your furnace is running and you're warm inside, you're confident that your plumbing and your tanks are gonna be heated also. Wow, that's Because even your gate valves are enclosed also in the Elk Ridge. Well, Brian, I can't tell you how impressed I am with the Heartland. And, you know, you taking the time to come down here really means a lot to the family. And we appreciate the opportunity that you've given us to offer your product. And we cannot wait uh, to just get started and, and uh, get selling more and more of these products and be able to offer them to our customers now. So very proud and very appreciative for you to spend so much time with our future customers. And uh, folks, if you have any additional questions about the Heartland, uh, please give one of our representatives a call at 1-800-335-6054, or you can visit us online anytime at mhsrv.com. Thank you all very much for watching, and we all look forward to hearing from you soon.